Hey guys, today I'm not even gonna bother to put makeup on because I am gonna do that thing. I am gonna clean my closet and I know that I'm gonna get so sweaty from this. <laughs> when you see what's in there, you're gonna understand what I'm talking about. So, this is what I'm dealing with. It's a total mess. Total, total mess. Like, it's stuff everywhere. So, what I'm gonna do today is to clean this mess up. G-Star, I think this is my push-up jeans. You have this kind of stuff, yeah, in here to make the ass a little bit bigger. It's a pretty cool, it's a pretty awesome, even without the push-up. I'm gonna keep them. I bought it in Tokyo. It's very fluffy and nice. I love this one. Why I'm doing this kind of video is because because I don't want to bore you with only makeup videos. Sometimes it feels like I only do like I do the same things over and over and over again and I feel like other YouTubers they're doing a lot of different stuff and I only do makeup videos. So sometimes I feel like I want to do something else because it's it's also fun for me to do different kind of stuff like like cleaning my closet together with you guys and I don't know it feels like sometimes well I wrote a post on my blog about that a couple of weeks ago about that I feel like my blog is boring and I've gotten boring <clears throat> I'm not sure but it feels like I'm doing the same things over and over again I've been in social media for for almost 10 years it's crazy I mean I started my blog at 2007 and 8 I think when I moved to another city because oh here's my YouTube t-shirt <laughs> yeah well yeah I when I moved to another city because I wanted to do something I wanted my friends and family to know what I was doing when I was living in another city so that's why I started my blog and when I started my blog I basically wrote about my life and what I did and everything like that and it didn't go that well uh, so I started in a makeup blog later and that went pretty well uh, and it went fast and soon I was one of Sweden's biggest makeup blogs, which was pretty awesome. But I was very, I was, I was from a small, I am from a small town and it, sorry guys, I just had to change battery. Well, I am from a small town and that was a big change for me to suddenly do something and I was a public person which I had a very hard time dealing with because I've always been very shy and um, 
yeah, like shy to new people. Some people think that I'm, oh, she's like, she's so bitchy and she don't want to talk to me. But it's not about that. It's about being shy and not really like to talk to new people. Like at work, it's no problem when I'm working. I, I love talking to new people at work. But in private, like on parties and stuff, I am, I'm not really like that. I can be very shy and yeah, that's that was a big change for me and I had a hard time with that change but it became better and this journey, I think this journey has made me a better person actually. I, I'm happy for things in life and I am, I feel like I've been I'm a more humble person now than I was then so I think this journey from from the small town girl I, I'm still a small town girl I will never I, I will never be like this city big city girl so I think this is just this has been a good thing for me this was not the point from the beginning at all I what I wanted to do when I took my makeup education was to like go into an agency um, do makeup full-time and not doing anything else and that was not really the case because I started blogging I worked at a makeup store in in that town I moved to Lynn shopping and when I did that, I also, yeah, I, I blogged about my life and stuff. And when it turned out to, you know, it, it turned out pretty well. And yeah, I felt like I had to do that. So social media happened and yeah, it's where I am right now. And sooner or later, I think I will go into an agency and work full-time as a makeup artist because that was what I wanted to do at, at first place. And, well, I'm not sure what I want to do, actually. I think I, I'm that kind of person that I want to do what I feel like right at that moment. Like, right now, I want to work with social media and YouTube and blogging and Instagram and I love pictures and editing and everything like that and so that's what I want to do right now but in, in a year I'm not sure I mean what in a year I have no idea and yeah well I have stuff coming up I do I have big stuff coming up and and um, hmm. yeah, I really enjoy my life right now, even though it's very stressful because it is, but I really enjoy it. God, guys, I have so much clothes in here, like, ah. Now I can actually walk on the floor again. Oh, uh, I have found so many stuff that I haven't seen in a while. I'll tell you that. Uh, this one is pretty. God, it's so dirty in here. Whew. Okay, at least I've started and I'm all sweaty and stuff. Ugh. There's a body as well, it's hanging, just hanging around. Okay, let's start with the fun part. It's this part. This is actually where I hang clothes that I like a little bit more, or dresses or stuff. So let's just grab the camera and come a little bit closer.
Look at this one. Once you've seen that this thing have eyes, I cannot really take it serious anymore. I don't know if I can keep this one. Because it's staring at me. It's freaking staring at me. <laughs> So now I'm gonna go through this shit down here, it's wigs and stuff. I actually coordinated all of my clothes here by color, so from black, yeah, and my fake furs and now I just have to deal with the wigs and then I have to deal with my shoes. So I still have... Um, some more time to spend in here um, okay guys one thing I had no idea that I had space up here what am I gonna keep up here because I'm too short I can't really reach it so all right but it's empty so I have more space yay I think I'm gonna keep my wigs up there uh, so I'm gonna go through my wigs this one is awesome. It's super curly um, synthetic wig from um, Powder Room D. Oh, kind of very cheap, but I kind of like it. I think it's cool. Blue, blue and black, black and blue. Then I bought this one also at the hobby store. It was very Swedish there. Uh, Butrix, where's the. Ah, this one. Oh, it looks super, super fake in this light. It actually looks better in real life. What else is there? Oh, it's this purple one. This is one of my favorites, actually. Um, it's also from Powder Room D. And as well as this one. This one I use a Pride. The Pride Parade this year, and it's one of my absolute favorites. Super curly and very. I love the color on this one. This is very pretty. I don't know what happened to it. It's a bit weird. This jacket is actually pretty cool, isn't it? I think I'm gonna keep this one. These, I'm not sure, they are pretty nice, actually, I love them, but I'm not sure if I'm gonna use them, okay. There's also a boot, I'm not really a boot girl, boots, keep them, I'm gonna keep all my boots. These shoes are pretty cool. I don't think I've ever used them because they're not very comfortable to walk in. They're cool. These ones are very pretty, but I never use them. This is also a very pretty shoe, but super uncomfortable. Like it's the most uncomfortable shoes that I own. Look at this heel. It's like, it's actually thinner than my little finger. Oh, these ones are from Mini Market. So cool, right? Okay, this is the thing. This is my favorite boots ever. I use them a lot. I bought them in London and one of them is gone. How can you lose a boot? I am done with the shoes. Now I'm just gonna vacuum clean in here and stuff, yeah, and maybe do some more and then I think I think I'm pretty ready. Ooh. Okay guys, so this is how it turned out in the end. Oh my god, this took me about four 
hours. Woo! Four hours to clean and stuff. And I'm so tired right now. And this is actually this is the kind of stuff that I cleaned out. Um, that I'm gonna give away or I don't know, do something with. I'm just gonna keep it anyway. I am very happy with how it turned out in the end and I promise you guys in one week it's gonna look the same again but I have faith in myself this time can you focus on me camera please thank you I'm so sweaty right now so I think I'm gonna go get a shower and then uh, I have to work I have to put some makeup on and like do some blog stuff and um, well that was all for today I hope you enjoyed this pretty long vlog but yeah this is how it looks like in my closet and now it's clean and I'm happy about it so I really hope you enjoyed this don't forget to click a like and subscribe to my channel and I'll see you again on Sunday bye guys <laughs>